Hello and welcome to my channel Mind Zion Inspiration and happy Boxing Day. I hope you've all had an absolutely lovely Christmas. This is just an extra reading today just for those who um, need it. This is going to be a collective reading so it's just going to be a general reading and uh, I'll do it with the empowerment that those that need this reading will be the ones that are drawn to it to watch it. Okay, so let's see what's in store for you. So success, you've got the six of stones here, look, success, success is on the horizon for you. And you've also got the ace of wands here. And the princess of wands. So, wow, success is on its way to you. You've got some kind of idea, some kind of intuition, some kind of thought that you have been thinking about. You need to follow your intuition and your guidance because that is what is going to lead you to this success and this good fortune that's coming your way. And you feel really, really passionate about this new beginning, really passionate about this idea. You can see the red flames here, the fire, the enthusiasm and the passion that's coming from you. But you really, really need to follow this guidance here, this intuition to lead you in the right direction. You've got the Princess of Cups here. So somebody is going to be helping you. This feels a bit like a mother figure. So if it's not your actual mother, then it's somebody that um, treats you like they're your mother. They look out for you. They do their best for you. And they're guiding you. And this person would have been in your life a long time. Because we've got these six stones here the stones that show history there's history between you and this person they're definitely older than you they can be male or female but they are in your life to help you and guide you through this situation and wow you've got the prince of cups as well look so definitely, definitely somebody here who is helping you through this situation that is guiding you. They could be related to you with the Cups card because there is definitely this emotional bond between you and this person. But if they're not related, then they have been in your life a long time and they certainly have those family emotions, those family feelings towards you. There could be some kind of message that you hear this week for those of you that um, are watching this reading. There's going to be some kind of message that comes to you this week, some kind of information. It's going to be important. It's going to help you to make a decision. So you need to take notice when it comes through. You've got strength. You see this person here with the snake wrapped around them you've got the strength to stand up against any opposition that comes your way and there will be opposition because whenever somebody starts a new business or a new venture or goes for a promotion there's always somebody that is jealous of them or somebody that is in competition with them but you know this opposition is no match for you. You certainly have the strength and the knowledge and the insight to defeat them. So, you know, don't sit there and think, I can't start this business up because so-and-so is already doing it and they're really well known and da da da, -da and I'm not going to, you know, there's no way I'm, I'm going to be better than them. Don't put yourself down. You've got the knowledge, you've got the insight, you've got the power. 
you've got the ambition and the drive and you can be just as good as them, if not better. So stand strong, work, the three of stones, look at that. It's all coming together. This is definitely something to do with your career and it's all coming together. It's going to start off definitely within the next three months. You're going to see movement towards that. Things starting to come together. Moving in the direction that you want it to move in. It looks really, really good. Come wow. The five of stones. So um, as the success starts to grow, you've got to put a lot of work into it. You know, it could be that to begin with, that um, it takes time for the finances to grow, but they will get better. But obviously, as you are growing this new business or grow, taking, starting this new job, you will go through a period of time where you need to get your finances straight as all the changes take place. It could feel that you will be struggling a bit financially, but the gains afterwards will definitely be worth it. The Eight of Wands definite strength eight again is the strength card you've got the strength and the power to see this through it will take your time it will take your effort it will take a lot of hard work you will struggle financially in the beginning but when the success comes it will be worth it it's a really really good you know new businesses or new ventures, new it takes time to climb the ladder, it takes time to get things off the ground. So, you know, don't expect it all on day one, it's not going to happen on day one, it is going to take time. But when you get there, it is going to be worth it. Chakra clearing, call upon me, Archangel Metatron, to clean and open your chakras using geometrical shapes. So, that's all about healing and clearing your energy spaces you know you've got the color purple there so wearing purple eating purple food you know asking the universe to help you clear your energy of anything negative so that the new things can come into your energy space and success can come. Hope you've enjoyed your reading this week. It's a bit different today with it being Boxing Day. I've not done a pick a card reading. I've just done a general reading. So I hope that um, it's resonated with you in some way. If it has, then click that like and subscribe button. And I hope I'll see you again next week. Don't forget to come back for your January readings. Thank you for watching.